I'm Naomi Davis. Uh, I'm with Asian Aid. I've been with Asian Aid for eight years now. I've been on the board. And uh, we're originally from uh, Auburn, Nebraska, a little town south of Lincoln. And then we moved our headquarters to um, out, just outside of Southern University in uh, outside of Chattanooga, Tennessee. And we find children in India who have been uh, abandoned by their families. We put them in orphanages, we find sponsors for them, and we give them Christian education and, and teach them about God. And uh, they go on and become ministers and teachers and doctors. We also uh, help the elderly over there with hungry money. Uh, they don't have a social security or welfare system there that's really good. And when the parents uh, become elderly and are too old to uh, work anymore, the, they just sort of come out of the house and they live along the streets and in cardboard boxes. So we give them money each month and it buys them food, rice mostly. Uh, it's not a big lavish diet, but they do get rice. They get two changes of clothes a year and two blankets a year. And so it sort of keeps them going. We have a well program also uh, where we um, dig wells for them and give them fresh water. Because due to the caste system over there, they will send their children to the local well. But if they're of a lower caste than the people at the well, they have to stand there and wait. They have to hide in the bushes and wait all day or they'll beat them and send them away. So the mothers send their children out in the morning and sometimes they don't know what time they'll come back whenever they can get water. And they put the water in big um, stainless steel pots and put it on top of their head and carry it home. Um, we're, right now we're building a new Sunrise Orphanage. Uh, it's out, just outside of Bobbley. Uh, we've had, well we've just had so many children come that we've outgrown it. And it's not in a very good neighborhood and it's not a very good building. So we're building a new one out in the country. And we have started um, building it. So we hope to have it done by Christmas, but we don't know. We run into a lot of things in India. Um, we're, right now we're trying to raise money to buy each child a bed. They have been uh, laying on the floor on blankets and that. So and it costs approximately $75 for each child to have a bed with mattress and a proper bed. So I moved down here a year ago and uh, I thought I'd come to camp meeting here and let everybody know about Asian Aid and what we do. And uh, I went over a year ago. We have Hope in Motion, uh, a series on Asian Aid that's on 3ABN every Friday evening. And I got to go over with the film crew and they filmed me meeting my sponsored child. And it was quite an experience. I got to see everything that happens in India and, and how we help our children. And if you see this one over here, uh, I was at the orphanage the day that she was dropped off. She was just abandoned by her Her parents died and someone else took her in. And uh, she was a stepchild, well she really wasn't a child at all. And over there they're not accepted by the mothers or the stepfather. So they brought her to the orphanage and they just dropped her off and I got to experience the fear she had, the sadness of it, and how devastating it is for a child. But within a month we went, uh, everybody went back and she was happy and she was adjusting. And as you can see she's a pretty happy girl now. So that's what Asian Aid's about and so I just came here to help people understand what Asian Aid's about.